Now on your home for minor league baseball, MLB The Show has coverage from the AAA Pacific Coast League. A Memorial Day get-together for you here at the ballpark between the Iowa Cubs and the San Antonio Missions. Standing in, Ian Miller, and we are ready for some daytime baseball. Outside, two and one. And he'll stay alive here, but just barely as this ball's chopped foul at the plate, and the count holds it two and two. And we should see some 90s as we go forward. 88 degrees, our game time temperature. Segovia, a range to his left as he tracks this one down in left center for the first out. Stepping up to the plate, Zach Short. One out, nobody on. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to one and two now. That misses, and we're even at two and two. He's up in the zone a lot right now. Sometimes that can be effective, but I think you have to be careful with that, especially during a day game where the ball tends to carry a lot more. But he'll barely have to move out there and right as he hauls this one in for the second out. That is third. Standing in, Josh Fegley. Josh. Mixed results for him in the series, three for 14. The 2 1 home. And a ball popped foul to the right side, out of play. The 2-2. Two -two. High and deep down the left field line. And this is going to get down. It's a foul ball. And good patience to hold back on the curveball in the dirt. It's full now, 3-2. Hey, I know the idea is to try to get the guy to swing on a 2-2 pitch, right? But that one was so low, I don't know anybody that would have swung at that pitch. The second baseman, Aaron Arnold. The 2-1 home. There's a swing and a high drive into left center field. Ranging back is Ray, but he has no chance to make the play. It's off the wall. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. That was good. The third baseman, Daniel Descalzo. At the plate now, Daniel Descalzo. Curve ball bounces, and this one gets away. Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Ready with the 3-1. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. Now with the plate, Mark Sagunas. Great chance to drive in a run here in the early going. One and one. Here it is. Swung on and missed. One and two now. Definitely a big pitch coming up right here. He's going to be pumped if he can work his way out of this inning with the game still tied. Back up the middle. And that's through into center field. Base hit. Oh, but it's offline, so the run will score. And not in time as he just crosses the plate in time. That is seven. The first baseman, number 19, Jared. So Young. now to the plate, Jared Young. A ball and two strikes now. I know he's been struggling early, but that pitch right there, well executed changeup. If he can mix that in, maybe. looking at a fastball to end the inning. Ready now, Corey Ray. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. No contact there, and it's one and two. And it's fouled away. He'll try again, one, two. And a changeup swung on and missed for the first down. So striding forward now, Jace Peterson. He's gone over his first six at bats in the series so far. 
below the zone a swing and a miss back to back strikeouts in the first right here pitcher is setting a tone pound in the zone and that's a swinging strike three in the dirt Fegley corrals it and he makes the throw to first Peterson is retired two down that's now. Good. So bases are empty here with two gone. And in next, the first baseman slash D.H. Ryan Healy. Pretty well struck. High and deep to left field. Looking up is the left fielder. To the track, to the wall. And that one is gone. Into the box, Logan Morrison. In there at the letters, one and two now. One ball, two strikes. This is line to left. Birch is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Digging in, Charcer Burks. Not a lot of success in the series for him. Two hits in 15 trips. The 1 1 home. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. 3 and 1 to him now. And that misses for ball four. So it's a leadoff walk here to start the second. Now to the plate, the pitcher, Adbert Alzale. And we'll likely see him square around to bunt. And the pitcher is, in fact, bunting here as he puts this one down. One there. Throw on to first. Won't be in time, so they just get the one there. Digging in for his second at bat, Ian Miller. Over one for him here in this one. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. The 1-2. Hit hard on the ground to the right. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now that's what the back to the plate now Zach Short that one's down around the knees taken for a strike still one and two as he fouls it away you can definitely tell with that foul off right there that he's picking up spin on this pitcher's off speed stuff maybe expect a fastball on this next one trying to get him to chase the curve ball away but it breaks outside two and two now And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. To second for one. The relay not in time as he beats the throw by a step. So it's first and third with two away. And that'll bring up the catcher, Josh Fegley. Pitch taken several inches below the zone, in fact. Has to be a challenge pitch coming up here. He probably doesn't want to flirt with loading the bases. Hit hard to third. Fielded cleanly. On to Healy at first, and the side is retired. Coming to the plate now, Lucas Ersig. And he comes in as a player to watch out for, hitting well over 300 on the season. Something has to give. Here's the payoff pitch. Skied into straightaway right. Zagunas is there to put it away for route number one. Striding in, Ronnie Rodriguez. Day off for him yesterday, but back out there for this one. The 3 1. And that's outside. He lost him ball four. Now to the plate, Juanjel Segovia. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. Working for the punch out and the offering. Had him fooled there as this is lifted in the air out to left center and shallow. And a great diving effort there, but it'll just tip off his glove and it's a base hit. 
the catcher, Dedgar. In now, David Fry. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. And that's off the left field wall. And to score is the runner from first. It's a three to two ball game. Batting up, the pitcher, Bubba Derby. Stepping in now, Bubba Derby. One and two now. One out and a runner on second base. Swing and a miss at the curveball, and there's your second out of the inning. Stepping into the box, Corey Ray, runner in scoring position with two gone. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And this one is gone, a home run. the plate Jace Peterson and he lays off the pitch down and away ball two well I think he just kind of lost focus on the mound right there it's clearly not going his way and he's thinking more about that than the task at hand and right now he needs to think about this hitter and he will get there to make the running play and that will end the inning Next will be the cleanup hitter, Hernan Perez. He scored a run after stroking a double in his first at-bat. And he's got to build off that last A-B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at-bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Fastball called, strike three, and there's the first out now of the inning. Third base. Bases are empty, and one man out. The Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Ray waits on it. Two gone. Digging in now, Mark Sagunas coming off the clutch. Two run single his last time up. Into the windup, here comes the 2 2 pitch. Grounded back up the middle towards second. Peterson is there. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Next in at the plate is Ryan Healy. And hey, it was a breaking ball to boot. This guy's a pretty good off-speed hitter. You could tell by that last that bad he wasn't fooled at all. He sat back, waited, got the breaking ball, and didn't miss it. Ah, changed things up on him, and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. And they'll try to get him fishing there, but he won't offer in the dirt, and it's back to even at two and two. Now here it comes. These are the kind of A.B.'s, regardless of the outcome, you go back to the dugout as an offensive player, and your teammates are loving on you for making that pitcher work and battling it out. Popped him up. Fegley over to his right. One out. Now at the plate, Logan Morrison hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, pretty unlucky right there, Matty. Squared up a fastball nicely, and that's all you can do. You just want to be on time for the heater, and he's prepared for this next A.B. The 2-2. Two -two. Lucas Ersig waits on deck. Good battle. Count remains full. And he'll hang in here as he reaches to foul this one away. The 3 2 one more time. Liner in there for a base hit. 
around first. He's digging for second. And now it'll rattle up against the wall. And he'll pull into second with one away. Now batting the third baseman. Lucas Ayrton. Into the box now, Lucas Ersig. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder giving chase. And they won't risk it at third, so they're at the corners now with only one now away. The shortstop. Ready. So now to the plate, Ronnie Rodriguez. Boy, and here's a drive. Deep left field, and the long ball's going to bite him for the third time today as this one is gone. A home run. Justin Steele is going to come on to pitch here, and in just the third inning, you have to think he'll be asked to eat some innings. Justin Steele. At the plate now, Juanjel Segovia. Swing and he pops him up. Looks to be playable in foul ground. Young is over now and he's got it for route number two. Trying to pick now things up where we left here. off. David Fry. He cashed in with a two run oh. double his first trip to the plate. Yeah, it's been an offensive explosion for him today. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everyone seems to be putting barrel on baseball in this lineup. The count now at two and one. He's fallen behind now, three and one. One thing that could nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offense. And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. At the plate, Jared Young. First time up, he went down looking. Yeah, always frustrating to go down looking. Everybody does it, though. You'll have a few A-Bs where you get completely fooled. Look for him to be on the attack early in the setback. Scooped up. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Settling in now, Charcer Burks. He drew a walk his first time up. The 1-1. One, one. one out, nobody on. One strike. Rolled slowly down the third baseline, but this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Now the pitch. We got three and two. Hit back up the middle. And that is through into center field for a one out single. The pitcher, Justin. To the plate now, Steele. Justin Steele. Now a bunt attempt here as he gets this one down. Only play to the pitcher covering, and the runner moves into second on the play. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Ian Miller. He's one for two in this one. Now the one and one pitch. Hit on the ground down the first baseline, but a foul ball. One and two the count now. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Drilled to first. And Healy will take this one himself to retire the side. So here now is the pitcher, Bubba Derby. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, Matty, big time K last time up, and it's been a tough series for him so far. You can tell he's just not seeing the ball off this team. Let's see if he can make an adjustment right here. Low with a fastball that time. Two balls and two strikes. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. Reined in. And an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Corey Ray. And he's coming off a two-run homer his last time around. 
And that last at bat when he went deep, he turned around a pretty good fastball. So I'm kind of thinking this guy's a good fastball hitter. So I might want to move that ball up and down and in and out and try not to throw it right down the middle of the plate. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. On the ground to the right side. Ah, it's flagged down deep in the hole. Throw gets him there from short right field. A nice play, and that one ends the inning. Coming to the plate now, Zach Short 0 for 2 on the afternoon so far. 3-2 pitch. Hits the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Stepping in, Josh Fegley. He was a ground out victim last time up. On its way is pitch number 75. Oh, and he hung him a curveball there, and he's going to live to regret it as this ball is going to wind up well over the wall in left field. A long home run. Man, you could tell by the sound of that one off the bat, that was going a long way. In now, Hernan Perez. Here's a good breaking ball as it gets the bottom of the zone. Hey, I don't mind that take right there. That was a nasty breaking ball. Started outside the zone, popped back inside the zone. Good spin rate on it. Move on to the next pitch. And he fouls this one off. The 2 2 one more time. Now a ball lined to the left side. But this is a foul ball. The 2 2 one more time. Daniel Descalzo waits on deck. Now the 3 and 2 pitch. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Now at the plate, Daniel Descalzo. He flew out in his last at bat. The 1 1 home. It's one thing to get hit around, but it's far worse when you're getting yourself into trouble by not throwing strikes. Every pitcher's been there, but it doesn't make it any less frustrating or unacceptable. Here now the 2-2. Bases are empty here with two men out. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. So digging in now, Ryan Healy he comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. The 1-1 home he is in there for the second strike. Fouled off. Two balls and two strikes to count to Ryan Healy. He might have to look for a different way to put this guy away on 2 2. He's already seen the curveball a couple of. Swing, high drive, left field and deep. And this will bang up against the wall. And he is into second base with a leadoff double. Standing in now, Logan Morrison. And he lost him here on 3-2 as that pitch misses. It's ball four. So coming to the plate, Lucas Ersig. He singled his last time up. Yeah, and they take another single right here. That third base coach is dying to wave his arms. I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield. He's going to wave them. Burks comes in a few steps as he hauls it in for the first out. In now, Ronnie Rodriguez. Keeley over at second. Morrison is over at first with one away. Hit out towards second. There's one. On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning.
Devin Williams takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. Number 38. Striding in once again, Mark Sagunas. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. The 2 1 home. Now a fastball swung on and missed in its full three and two. He was able to sneak that fastball by him on three and one, so so now we've got a battle on our hands. Tough pitch to lay off, but he did, and it's ball four, so the leadoff hitters aboard to start the sixth. Jared Young. A one and one count. Here's the pitch. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Got to believe the pitcher's going to trust his defense right here. Look for something down in his zone to induce a ground ball double play. Ground ball sent back up the middle. He's got it. One there. Relay throw, but it'll be too late as he's well safe at first. Ready for another chance? Charcer Burks. Charcer Burks. A little behind on that swing, and now he'll try to shorten up maybe and protect the plate. The one and two pitch. Hey, he threw that pitch with a purpose to get a double play. Good job to let it go by, though, as a hitter. Hit on the ground to third. Right to him. The second for one. Relay on to Healy for the double play, and that retires the side. Bottom of the sixth inning now. Now in the box, Juanjel Segovia. In his last at bat, he popped out in foul ground. Yeah, we used to have a saying right here you would stride to the plate for this AB trying to chop wood. Not in today's game. You just want to get your bat plane on the same path of the ball. Can't continue to swing under those elevated heaters. Now that Stepping in and ready for another shot, yeah. David Fry. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. A ball and two strikes. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. And that's into the corner. A foul ball and right. The 2-2 two -two one more time. High in the air down the right field line. But this will wind up being a foul ball. The 2 2 one more time. On the ground to the left side. And in the left field for a one out hit. CJ Inahosa will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number 30, CJ Inahosa. Had to sit back on the changeup, and he did a good job to get the bat on that one. He'll try it again, three and two. This is skied into the air to straightaway center. Miller is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. Now at the plate, Corey Ray. Perhaps he can drive another one out of the park, just like he did back in the second. Set and the 2 1 pitch. And it's two balls and two strikes now. And he lays off, so it's full now, three and two. Three two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. A bouncer up the middle, fielded cleanly, throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. Shelby Miller is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 45. Corbin Joseph is up off the bench as he'll pinch hit here to start inning number seven. One and two now. Two 
popped up. Ersig waits on it. Makes the play one away. At the plate, now Ian Miller is working on a one for three Ian thus far. Miller. Bases are empty, one man out. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Stepping in, Zach Short. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Now the one and one pitch. Fouled away. Into the windup. Here comes the 2 2 pitch. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's working full now at 3 and 2. Full count still. Two out, nobody on. Down the first baseline. But this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. On the eighth pitch of the at bat is the one that finally does it as he wears him down, and the inning is over. Tyson Miller gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. Ready for another shot now. Jace Peterson. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. The 1-1. Hit on the ground out to short. Scooped up. And the throw to first is in time. One gone. Digging in and looking for more. Ryan Healy. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. In the air to center field and deep back is the center fielder. Back he goes, but this is going to be a home run. Not every home run is exactly the same. That ball was absolutely destroyed. Plate, Logan Morrison. Ball. To two balls and two strikes now. Two balls, two strikes. Not Three. close with that when it's way above the strike zone. No pitcher likes to take the count to three and two, especially when you throw a non-competitive pitch like that on two and two. That one wasn't even close. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Now so stepping in, Lucas Ersig. It was a fly out for him in his last trip. Could take there to lay off the high fastball. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Burks is there, makes the catch, and the side is retired. Ready to begin the eighth. Into the box now, Josh Fegley. He went deep last time up. And in that last at bat, it makes you think this guy might have went up there looking for the breaking ball because he certainly got a breaking ball and he didn't miss it. Hit it right on the screws. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. So now here's the cleanup hitter, Hernan Perez. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. The 2-1. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. The 2-2. Two -two. Gets him looking up around the letters. Digging in once again, Daniel Descalzo. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there. And the center fielder is under it to make the catch, and the inning is over. Digging in to try it again. Ronnie Rodriguez. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. 
It's one and two. With this one almost in books, the story was clearly the long ball. What are your thoughts on this offense, fellas? Well, Matty Viado. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. Throw on to first in time, one away. Ready once again, Juan Hill Segovia. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Segovia. Change up. Good pitch there. One and two. Out in front as this is skied in the air to straightaway left. Burks will get there with ease as he puts it away for route number two. Into the box now. David Fry. Two for three with a double on his line so far. The 2-1. Three and two now. High and deep to right center. Right fielder giving chase. He threw first and hustling for second. And now that will hop over the wall. So he'll be at second here with two away on a ground rule double. Three Maybe trying to back him up a bit there with the fastball. Corey Ray would be next. Now a swing and a ball popped in the air back behind short. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. Luke Parker comes on from the pen hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. All set to start the ninth in this one. So striding in, Mark Sagunas. It was a walk in his last trip. Now the one and one pitch. Two balls, one strike. Count even at two and two. Here it comes. And he takes something off there as this is swung on and missed, and there's one gone here in the ninth. The first baseman. Into 19. the box, Jared Young. Jared. He could really use a Young. knock here, 0 for 3 in the game so far. Neither guy willing to give in, and the ad battle continue. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Chasing after it is Ray. He gets there, and that's the second out. Now batting, Charcer Burks, a hit in two official trips to the plate to this point in the ballgame. Popped him up. Airsig is there. Makes the catch, and that's the ball game. Hey, one of the keys to having a good record in baseball is to win some games at home. So this was a big win to win at home in front of their home crowd. Nine to three, the final tally here in this one. San Antonio took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Bubba Derby takes the win on the mound, his second of the year. Adbert Alzale is slapped with eight earned runs as he takes the loss. So that's it for us this afternoon. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to theshownation.com. for the victorious mission. Nine runs on 11 hits. No errors. They left four men on base. For Iowa, three runs, five hits. No errors. They left six men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 34 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.